The name of my book is Dear Hannah, A Geek's Life in Self-Improvement. But I also like to call it a cautionary tale about self-improvement. Maybe you've always suspected that something's been missing in your life. So you stumble over into the self-help section of book people and you rifle through the covers. And one of them sort of sticks out at you. It says, awaken the giant within. You're like, OK, what the hell does that mean? Um, the author's name is Tony Robbins, who you might have heard of. And on the cover is a picture of a tall, handsome man with square jaws. And you think, OK, maybe this guy has some answers. I, sh I should be listening to everyone. So you rifle through the book, and you notice he's talking about things like the power of intention, or the power of, fo of focus, or the power of insert whatever buzzword you want. It doesn't really matter. The point is, Tony has the power of persuasion, and you're hooked. So you decide, OK, why not? I'll take this book home. You read the book, take it home, and then you step in front of the mirror, and you say things to yourself like, you're the man, Phil. You got this. Today is the first day of the rest of your life. This moment right here will change the entire trajectory of my life right here, right now. And you say those things to yourself, and you feel amazing. You are so filled with energy that you might literally jump out of your chair, run to your fridge, and throw out all of the junk food that you have. You might then go across the street to Castle Hill and sign up for a one-year membership. Heck, you might even summon the courage to then walk further up the street to Whole Foods and ask that cashier on a date that you've been meaning to ask for for a long time. Next morning, you step in front of the mirror and you say the same words. And maybe they don't feel as good as they did yesterday, but you're still feeling pretty amazing. So much so that when you go to work, everyone just sort of acknowledges you more. You just feel more present around your boss, around your coworkers, more in command. Third day rolls around, you're still feeling pretty damn great. You start to think, you know what? I think I actually changed my life. I think everything's different now. And so you post about the book on Twitter and Facebook. You tell your friends, dude, you got to check this out. This book is changing my life. I, I read it a couple days ago. I know it's kind of weird, Tony Robbins, but you got you to listen to what he's talking about. And heck, you even sign up for a conference uh, with Tony Robbins. You put out pull out your credit card and charge of 1500 bucks for an audience with Tony Robbins in Las Vegas. Oh wait, sorry, it's actually $5,500 for an audience with Tony Robbins. That's the gold package. The silver package is $1,500, and it's only with one of his lieutenants. OK, fine. You'll still do that, 1500 bucks. But then one or two weeks later, you can sort of see how this story goes. You step up in front of the mirror. You say the same words, and nothing happens. The words are completely meaningless. You start to panic, and you start to panic because now you're signed up for this conference, now you're signed up for this gym membership, and now you are dating someone under false pretenses. <laughs> what you thought was confidence actually turned out to be just plain old-fashioned mania. Now, for Tony Robbins, this isn't a problem. It's no big deal, actually. Those two weeks was enough of a stretch of time for you to be empowered, to feel great about yourself, to sign up for a conference, and to refer the book to more friends who are now going to begin their own two-week process of getting excited and referring the book to friends. And this, my friends, is exactly how memes work. My book, Dear Hannah, shows this cycle for exactly what it is. It contains 82 letters written over 16 years describing every self-help book, every pop psych article, every personal invention I used, to ch uh, used or abused to change who I am. It's been a labor of love for three years, and I really hope you enjoy it. I'm going to be selling and signing copies here at a discount to what you can get online. So get them while supplies last. And thank you so much for coming. Any questions?